My name is Alyssa. I'm the marketing manager at Rescue. We've been getting a lot of emails and messages about a fly trap being full and what to do with it, how to dispose of it. I happen to have one in my yard right here, so I'm going to show you how I like to dispose of my fly trap. You can see the trap is pretty dried out. You want to dispose of the trap when it's dry, when it's full of flies, and no more can get in, or after 30 days, whichever of those three things come first. So for me, the fly trap is dried out and it's also been about 30 days, so it's time. So how I like to do that is with a plastic bag. You can use any reused plastic bag, whatever you want to do. I like to just do that to contain any liquid that might leak out just as a precaution, but you can, uh, you can use any one you want. And the lid also closes just like this. So it doesn't stay shut perfectly. It just kind of, just kind of snaps just to give you a little bit of closure. So you want to either contain it with a plastic bag or carefully get that shut in there. So I like to wrap it like this tie it off and depress that lid and now it's ready for me to throw away. It's trash day tomorrow for us so this is the perfect time for me to get that into the garbage and not have to smell it for the next week. <laughs> next I'm going to show you how to hang a new trap. Here's a new trap here. Now you can see that the bait package here is up at the top. That, that's a lot of times how it looks right when you've purchased it so first give it a shake and now you have the bait pouch at the bottom here. Now you just take a pair of scissors and you just start kind of at one of those trap wrinkles and you really just cut right along this little circle right here. So just like that. Just cut along there like that. Look at the other side. Now, I like to hang mine and put the string through before I fill it with water. That will help me avoid accidentally dropping it. Anyone who's used our fly trap before knows they don't want to accidentally drop this. So I like to hang it first and then fill it. So I've put my just garden twine through it. You can use any string or wire you, you have around. And you just pop open that top just like that. And now it's ready to hang. So I'll tie it off and hang it from the fence post that I've been hanging the other one from. There we go. So, get it secure first, and now it is ready to add water. So I just use a watering can, but you can use a water bottle or whatever you've got around, even a hose, but what you want to keep track of is on the back, this is the fill line right here. So you're going to add water to that fill line. So here I go. Just getting water, watching that fill line. And the bait pouch is going to dissolve. A couple of hours, I won't see that bait pouch anymore. Now I've put it to the fill line. That bait pouch will dissolve and we'll start trapping flies. So. That is how you dispose of and then rehang a new fly trap.